In this video, I'm going to go over the creation process for making a graded assignment in VoiceThread. In another video, I cover ungraded discussion style. It will have a different way that students log into and a different way of creation on, on both of those will be different. It'll be different for students. It'll be different for instructor for creation. Creating the link is the same. That base link, we go to Content Market, just like we covered in a, a different video, and click to add a voice thread. That's the same. Where it gets different and a really important step that you can't skip is rather than clicking this link, what you would do in Ungraded, you have to actually edit this a bit in Ultra before you can successfully create a graded assignment. So we're going to go ahead and click the More Options ellipsis here and edit. And we're going to go ahead and just change the name a bit. We'll go ahead and make it visible to students. I tend to always allow class conversations for almost everything, and so I'll turn that on. And the most important thing here is to create a gradebook entry for this item. We'll just not worry too much about exact points that we want to use, but we need to add some. And then we need to add a category. If it's a discussion, that's clear. There's also, and we'll go over this in more detail, how you can make the equivalent of a presentation assignment and the equivalent of a homework assignment. But for now, we'll just focus on discussion. So the most important thing is that we've made it a graded item. Everything else we could go back and edit if we needed to. And we'll go ahead and save. And it doesn't look different yet, but when you click on this link like you would have to make an ungraded, it's going to have a new option for you that it didn't have in the ungraded version. And you would not have this option if you created it and then you went ahead and set it up and then you wanted to make it graded. It's a different type of voice thread. You'll notice that now there is assignment builder and that's something different that you have. If you do not see this, it's because you haven't made it a graded item within Ultra. So we'll go ahead and click that and you'll see that there's three different options now. And I'm gonna break these down in their own videos but I just wanted to show you how you go through the process of making a graded assignment and then split off to three different options in three different videos. 